Earlier today, the Detroit Lions were paid a special visit by some NFL players as part of the league's mentoring program. Our own Reggie Greengrass was there to witness the heartwarming scene. Reggie, I bet the Lions had the time of their lives. They certainly did, Mark. The look on the Lions' faces when their favorite player showed up, their eyes were as big as saucers. Well, you can hardly blame them. It's not every day they get to hang out with actual NFL athletes. Definitely. And these Lions uh, have been through so much. Not winning a game last year, bad draft decisions, Matt it's Millen. It's really sad, Mark. I mean, no team should have to endure what the Lions have had to go through. Most people just write the Lions off as lost causes. That's exactly Exactly right, and people don't understand how much it means to a Detroit Lion when some real professional football players take the time to teach how to make a tackle. Oh, wow, they'll remember that for the rest of their lives. Oh, and yeah. the Giants and Mod Bradshaw was there too, right? Yes, at one point Bradshaw had the ball, and he was kind of like play running towards the end zone, and one by one the Lions were jumping all over him to tackle him, but they couldn't bring him <laughs> down. He scores the touchdown, and they all fall into a big heap laughing. It was so adorable. Yeah, well, and that's a great lesson for the Lions too. Just do your best and have fun. That's what's important, right? Yeah, they had fun all right. At yeah. one point, this young Detroit Lion, Jerome Felton, uh -huh. he marches right up to Kyle Bowler and asks him for an Autograph. Yeah, they're not shy, those Lions. Yeah. I imagine the experience really brought the whole Lion, the, the Lion team closer together as well. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, early in the day, some of the Lions had been teasing Kevin Smith because he kept dropping the ball and tripping on his shoelaces. Yeah. But Terrence Holt told the Lions that friends and teammates always help each other when things are tough. And that's a good lesson for them to learn. Yeah, and by the end of the day, Kevin was catching some passes and even running them into the there end zone. Go. The Lions, who were making fun of him before, even started calling him Touchdown Kevin. Oh, that's, that's really nice, especially coming from Holt. He used to be a Lion himself. That's right. He, he told the Lions that with hard work, dedication, a little bit of luck, someday they could get out of Detroit, too. Wow, I'm getting a little misty here. Thanks for, uh, thanks for the story, Rich. Yeah. Hey, coming up next, the Baseball Hall of Fame is inducted into the Hall of Halls of Fame.